Hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. In the last part, we uh, got a little further in the Crystal Palace. We took out some uh, more uh, imposters. And uh, yeah, we were running low on FP. And as you can see, I'm about to level up in about 20 star points. So we last left off when there was going to be a battle. So, crap. Okay guys, I'm back. And uh, I am even closer now. I'm like 12 star points away from level up. So my FP problem will be solved a little bit, but uh, my FP and my SP per, uh, problem. And I got the palace key, and I think that means we're getting close to the boss, which uh, I might have to go back and cut some stuff, or, you know, all that crazy stuff that I do. Okay, so let's go up here. Oh no, we're not close to the boss yet. We gotta go through a couple of doors, right? And what's great about keys in this place is if you unlock one door, it unlocks both of them. If it has a reflection. I love that. Okay, so this. You can't go through here unless you solve the puzzle. Once you solve the puzzle, we'll let you through. So basically, these guys move when these statues mo move. Excuse me. So first of all, we're going to move him on there. And he's not completely on there, so... And you can only... You can't... You, the only way you can move these guys is by pushing back. So if you want to push, if I want to push this one forward, I have to talk to him like that. But that's not the way I want to push it. So I have to turn around and talk to him again, and he'll and he'll say the same thing. So what I'll do is I'll push this forward. There, that's one solved. And this one's easy. We just push him onto there. That took nothing. But if you want to find out what he says, you just talk to him. I think he's the same thing. Yep, they all say the same thing, so... I need to move him the other way, so... Well, that's not the way I want to move him, so... Let's just talk to him this way. So, yeah. These guys, I thought I'd have to fight them, because these guys are in Super Mario World. They are a pain. You have to hit them a couple times just to try and kill them. So in this game, I would imagine it would take quite some, a bit of effort to beat them. So I need to talk to him, need to get him to talk this way so I can move him onto that. And uh, we'll do that now. This puzzle is not that difficult. It's fairly easy, as you saw. <laughs> I think that's the pathway to the Crystal King. I'm not sure though. I'll have to take a quick look. Yep. Yeah. This is the pathway to the Crystal King. So rather than me cutting a bunch of stuff out, I think what I'll do is I will meet you guys back here. I'm going to go and get uh, um, health ups and stuff. I'll level up in between there, but uh, I'll tell you right now, I'm going to upgrade my FP anyways. So I will come back here when I go get my items. Be right back, guys. Okay, guys, I'm back, and I've gotten my items, and I did level up. And I got 10 star points, and now, just now, the enemies in this area are giving me crappy star points. So, well, that's good, because now we're about to fight the boss. So let's go do this. He's... Who comes to my palace? Oh my, the Crystal King. Actually, the first time I saw him, I thought you couldn't, you needed Spike Shield to jump on him, but no. They're not that mean. Mario, you finally arrived! <laughs> I know you be I know you believe you can save the Star Spirit, but I'm afraid I won't let you! First I shall defeat you, then I shall present Bowser with a nice Mario gift! Alright, so let's take this Joker out. This guy isn't too tough. He has a ton of HP though, that's one of the big things. So let's go ahead and start off. I'm just gonna go ahead and use uh Get this out of the way. Use this item up. And my phone has to ring again. It's been ringing all day. Like, I've been having bad luck with that phone thing. I hope my dad gets it, because I cannot answer it right now. Alright, so he makes more of those little guys. They only have one HP, so they're not tough. 
But uh, instead of doing what I did before because that was stupid, I'm just gonna use Mario and do the, most of the damage to him and then use Air Raid. I guess Cooper's good to use here, but it's easier if I if you use uh, Paracarry because he can hit airborne enemies. And that, if you don't block that, he freezes you, and that's hard to time. It took, I, I got hit by that so many times in my practice battle. It's ridiculous. I'm doing alright against him, though. I've almost got him down 20 HP. And I've said that he's probably going to heal. He tends to do that. Nope. He's not going to heal. Alright. That's good. Then the damage that I'm doing will, will, uh, won't be for naught. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use Power Bounds against him. Just because I felt like it. Because he has a lot of defense. Yeah, I blocked that. Alright, power bounce time. Oh, I screwed that up. Oh, man. That was stupid. Probably get rid of this guy in, like, no time. Ugh. Okay, this time when I use power bounce, keep hitting the button. Ah, oh, That's a waste of FP. And wow, I am screwing up the action command like no tomorrow. Anyways, this is his big gimmick. He can turn into three people. Now, you could play a guessing game and try and guess which one it is. And Cooper could probably hit these guys, but you know what? I like to use Air Raid to figure out which one it is. So we know which one it is now. Now, let's try and use Power Bounce and not fuck up. There we go. That did quite a bit of damage. Oh, I can't believe I keep blocking that. That is so lucky. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and use Refresh because we might need uh, FP with uh, Paracarry again. I probably didn't even have to go back and get my items because I'm doing a lot better this time than I did last time. But, you know, it's always to be safe. See, this guy is not that bad. As long as you get your action commands right, you're, you're safe. But I used to be so bad at them. I'm even still a little bad at them. Look at that. He just healed himself a ton of HP. I'm going to start saving my FP because I'm going to need it. Alright, there you go. Alright. See, now he floats in the air. And now he does it. This is why you want Paracarry because uh, he can hit multiple targets almost anywhere. Alright, so Paracarry. Alright. I'll let you go first, and we'll use Air Raid with you. There we go. Gotcha. You can't fool Mario. And, uh, you know what? I'm just gonna jump on you, because I have an idea for later. I have just enough FP for it, too. And I blocked that. Yeah. Bam. He's getting down in HP again, so he might try to heal himself again. Be the devil. That gets annoying. And you have to wait for some reason. I don't know why. I guess for the happy heart to see if it'll kick in. Nelson Murray can get so happy. No, I should stop doing that. Here we go, he's flying up again, and he's gonna make copies of himself. Or as Ty would say, he's making copies of himself! Oh, Digimon. Digimon the movie. I was just talking yesterday to my buddy, uh, Geo396, about, uh, about Digimon the movie, and he said the only time he saw Digimon the movie, he had terrible heartburn and he missed half the movie. I'm like, oh man, you need to watch it. It's such a good movie. Such a good movie. Oh, it's a classic, man. Alright, anyways. Um, I'm going to start by uh, eating this cake. And 
Mandel, you use a shooting star. And that is, doesn't matter how much defense you have, it does full damage. Which I love. It's easier to... That's why I should start using... Get Mari to use items. And I block that. Alright. Bam. He might heal himself again. I'm not sure if he does, but he might... Nope. He's gonna be an idiot. All the better for me, I guess. You know what I might do? I might, um... Yeah, I'll use Paracarry for this. There we go. Got him. Now let's finish him off, or try to anyways. Oh, he has one HP! Are you kidding me? Oh, and of course he had to freeze me on the last time. You know what? Paracarry's gonna take him out. And he is down. The Crystal King is down. 42 star points. I'm on my way to another level again. Oh no, the last star spirit! King Bowser, forgive me! Let's hope he can pass on. And that's right, we've now got ourselves the last star spirit. It'll take its time to appear. Alright, let's see if I can do this. Let's see. Oh, I gotta do this carefully. Yes! <laughs> I got it on the spin side. You guys know what that means. End of chapter! Alright, Mario has saved the last star spirit, Kalmar, from Clamor? Or Kalmar? Kalmar, yeah. From the Crystal Palace at the edge of the world. Now, with the seven star spirits together, he has the power to challenge Bowser and the Star Rod. At last, it is time for Mario's showdown with evil King Bowser. Can Mario rescue Princess Peach and recover the Star Rod, or will wishes forever go ungranted? Um, let's just do, uh, continue without saving, because we've got some time. Let's do this interlude, it's the last one. Oh, Mario, I wonder what he's doing now. I wish I knew if I was helping him at all. Of course you are. Mario will be fine. You should be proud of your efforts. Mario knows all you've done. And don't worry, Princess, you'll be able to talk to him in person before long. Tee -hee. I hope you're right, Twink. Thanks for cheering me up. Let's go back to the room, shall we? Oh, great. I gotta do my Bowser voice. Oh, I said I was gonna record soon. Oh, Princess Peach, you cut your cuddly old Bowser is here. <laughs> he, just lo he just thinks he's so awesome. That he's get like kidnapping Princess Peach is totally gonna make Peach want him. Can't we have a friendly conversation for a change? Come on, let me see a smile. Cause there's a ton of Bowser kids or Koopa kids, and I have a feeling they're all his kids. But then there's Junior Koopa or Junior Bowser or Bowser Junior, whatever. So people don't even know. Like some people say that the bosses of Super Mario World are his kids, but then there's Bowser Junior. So who knows? I have nothing to say to you. Oh, don't be such a pill. You're stuck with me for a long, long time, beautiful. You better get used to it. Ah, oh, my head itches. Okay, enough itching. Mario is coming, Bowser, and you can't stop him. <laughs> oh, you poor silly girl. I'm invincible with the star rod, don't you know? Don't you know? Mario's no match for me. He's history. Get over it. I don't know. You're watching this. We have an emergency. Urgh, this better be important. I'm right in the middle of a friendly chat with the princess. Uh, Mario has saved all the star spirits. 
There is a chance he could come here using that power. We must make ourselves ready in case he shows up. What? Yeah, uh, Mario. Mario? <laughs> okay, listen, Gammy Koopa. Send everyone to their posts. We'll ambush the, him the second he enters my castle. Princess Peach, why don't you come with me to watch? You can have a front row seat to see Mario get crushed. You. Yeah, you. Tie her up immediately. If she, <laughs> if she gets out this time, heads will roll. No, please! You big Koopa, show some respect to the princess! What's with this whining little glittering thing? Confetti? Gah, buzz off! <laughs> Twink! Take that! Take the princess now! Let's move! <clears throat> no! That's the last interlude with the princess. And this is the last time we'll probably hear one of the last times we'll hear the star spirit music my name is Kalmar Mario well done thank you for coming you have successfully rescued all the star spirits we are in your debt now all that is left for you to challenge Bowser Montiara! look at his mustache my powers should help you to bring back the star rod to beat Bowser to bring peace back to the mushroom kingdom and to save Princess Peach Alright, I think, I can't remember, I think his power is, goes up by 7, and you now he's up and away, and you start your power with him, and away you can turn it in, and the stars. Um, I don't know what that does, but we'll figure it out at some point. So he's just saying he's, we need to go to Star Way. We need to go to the, uh, basically the place where we first saw the Star Spirits, where they asked for our help, and, uh, go back there. But really quick, because I got time for this, is there's two things I want to get. First of all, um, first of all, uh, we need to go over here. There's something that I, like, I forgot to get in here. Like, like, and I can't believe I forgot it. Oh, it's just this way. Can I go this way? Why do I always do that? I always go the wrong way, damn it. This isn't good for time, because I can't cut anything out of this chunk. Well, this part ends up being over 20 minutes, oh well. Anyways, go over this way, and uh, go through here. And, yeah, I accidentally, I examined this wall and I blew it up with uh, Bombette when I wasn't recording. So, uh, but yeah, that revealed a hidden room, and I thought that's what it was. And there's one enemy guarding this thing, and he's going to catch me, I think. It's almost impossible to avoid him. So you know what? I'm gonna first strike him. Crap, there's <laughs> four of these guys. I do not like this. Luckily, I have full FP. <laughs> so you know what that means, guys. And full Star Spirit energy. So you know what? I'm just gonna Star Storm you. Oh, you know what? Let's try the new ability. Uh, while I'm at it. Uh, up and away. Let's see how let's see how it works. It's actually the perfect opportunity. Oh wow! It actually worked fairly well. I didn't get any star points, but they would have given me crap anyways. That is that actually is really useful. I thought it was gonna be another crap power, but that is actually really useful. Anyways, let's go ahead and get this. The triple dip badge. Uh, with this, we can use three items at uh, once, but I think it costs more FP and more BP. Let's just take a quick look. Um, double dip. Yeah, triple dip takes twi more than twice the FP. It takes three times the FP. Uh, the BP. So that might be a problem. So we may not use triple dip. I mean, double dip's good enough. But I just wanted to get that to show you guys. Um, so we'll, uh, there's also one more thing I have to get that I forgot to get before we move on. So I will show that to you real quickly. Real quick like. So I want to get out of this dungeon and stop recording for today because I recorded, what, this will be the third part of recorded today? <laughs> that's, I guess that's not a lot, but I got this whole Crystal Palace done and I'm just like, I am done with you. Oh, whoops, <laughs> I went the wrong way again. I am SMRT smart, you know that? 
So freaking smart. Jeez. This part's gonna be like 20 minutes. Or more. Uh, I always hate saying that because then, then when the video goes up it ends up being less than 20 minutes and then I'm wrong. I tend to be wrong a lot. So now that we're on the other side, let's go over here. And there's a star piece! So we got a star piece. Alright. Anyways, guys. Next time on Let's Play Paper Mario, we'll be on the other side of this because... That's cool. <laughs> so I'll see you then. Or, not on the other side, but I'll be... Whatever. <sighs> whatever, I'll see you next time. We're gonna do some backtracing. Some backtracing, so... I'll see you later, guys.